my, I, I'd actually, know. I'm I'd speechless. Know. Like, <laughs> who would have thought, like, I've now invested in 500. <laughs> not 500. Oh, literally. Oh, it's, my. It's, it's absolutely goodness. crazy. I don't <laughs> I know I don't <gasps> get, I don't I don't get it either like it's, it's just making- in this video guys we're going to be talking about how to open up an account with trading 212 so you can go ahead and invest and this is predominantly for the people in the UK because in America they have trading um, no they have actually Robinhood and some crazy stuff that you can't use here Robinhood is yet to come but trading 212 best platform that i've used so far so yeah so i guess this will be for people like um like yourself who are looking to mm-hmm. get started with trading but you're not sure if you want to take it serious or yet maybe you want to dip your toes in and see what is you know what is all this about you know so by the end of this video you're going to be owning a free share okay <laughs> <laughs> literally a free oh share there's nothing gosh. to you know all, all you have to literally put in is one pound and yeah. Um, uh, yeah, your, your, your sh- the share is yours. You guys can do the same as well. Link will be in the description to be able to claim your free share up to one hundred pounds. Which, if you ask me, absolutely crazy. So, with all of that being said, YouTube is Ronnie MP. Whoop! It's Ronnie MP.com. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Join my free gift card giveaway, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and turn on the notification. Then let me know that you subscribe down below. Hey yo, what's good, YouTube? You know who it is. It's your boy Ronnie MP. Thank you and welcome to a brand new video of It's Ronnie MP, the show where we bring you guys a bunch of videos suggested by guess who? You guys and you guys only. So if you are brand new to the channel, then you know what? Let's just stop the video right now. You know what? Stop the music best thing you can do is smash the like button okay it means a ton not only for myself but it gets this video in front of the youtube algorithm and then it gets it to like-minded people like myself and you who are struggling with investing you're like you know what i've heard of investing but it seems too difficult way too difficult to get started well this is the video for you so be sure to watch this video from the start all the way till the end because i'm going to be doing a step-by-step how to get started with trading 212 okay so far hands down since 2016 the best app um that's been around for trading in the uk um robin hood is still in america um and they, they, they're working there i mean the speculation if they're making a platform um for you know uk users or not but as of now there isn't one that's available so trading 212 is your best bet so we're going to be diving in i'm going to i mean sit down take 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 a chill okay or relax relax literally right now and um we're going to get into it so this is my brother as i mentioned ab first time um, i'm sure you guys seeing him on this channel um but we're going to be, to be going through step by step on how to open up a isa uh account um which you will hear more about later um you know later on in the video but we're going to be opening that up and um, basically just seeing um if you know if it's something that you want to do long term mm-hmm. and um I, I guess you know i mean he's he is definitely i can I can vouch for this. He's definitely 100% excited to get started, but he has what I had in the beginning. Like you're not quite sure, yeah. you know, and you know you don't know what account to open up, the invest account, the CDF account, um, or you know the ISA, and you don't know what the benefits are. So he's gonna be asking me a bunch of questions that he's got written down, um, down here, and I'm gonna be answering it with him as well as we're gonna be opening up a ISA account mm-hmm. step by step. So you guys will get to benefit from absolutely everything Mm -hmm. okay so we've got his phone plugged in um we're gonna make a start so you guys should be able to see his phone when i switch um i do switch to it um right now okay so you can see his phone right there so basically what i done was i sent ab um the link um for trading 212 for you guys starting right now this you're gonna need this link to be able to get a free share if you open up your account without this link then guess what you won't be getting a free share so you're gonna need this link (laughs) yeah that's that's what i've got (laughs) provided for you guys in the description this way it will give you a free share and it'll give me a free share as well so we both get a free share and in fact i'm curious to find out which share you get my first ever share that i got was of um america 
what was it? Bank of America, did Bank I tell of, you? Yeah, yeah. Bank of America, um, which has been earning me um, some good dividend earnings. So I'm, I'm, I'm very happy about that. Um, it was worth 19 pounds. You might get a share that is worth 100 pounds, which I know. For literally, and I don't get why people don't do this. Oh literally, my gosh. It, you all you have to do is deposit in one pound, and then you can get a share that's worth up to a hundred pounds. And you can do this twenty times. So meaning you can send it. You can send once you sign up, you deposit the, uh -huh. the one pound in. You can send it out to your friends, and um, uh, you know, and you can do this twenty times and get different shares. So. Which I I know it baffles me because this is something that you could just le le leave in the account and then maybe in ten years twenty years time <laughs> it's grown it's grown and yeah. you're making thousands from 100%. it so do you see what I mean mm -hmm. so this is exactly what we're gonna be doing right now step by step and I know you're definitely gonna find value in it once more if I mentioned if you did then smash that like button. <laughs> It means a lot for the YouTube algorithm and do everything else um, that you see below. Click in the like button and then click in the subscribe button as well. So whilst he does that, I'm gonna get AB to um, open up the app um, and then we'll be able to get started and I'll show you guys um, as as he clicks on the yeah. link. So click in the link. So I'm literally, I'm so curious, like, mm -hmm. I've never done this before. So I'm just thinking, how do I just it's get the, the free It's the first time share? for everything. <laughs> uh, I download it, right? Yep, click, click, link, click, yep, it. click. So you guys will see that cloud um, as the, the, the download goes on. If it takes too long, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip it so you guys don't wait too much. But I've had him a year ago, maybe two years ago, just play around with the app with a practice account. Not So he's never deposited real money into it whatsoever. Practice account. Yeah, but now we're downloading the real deal. It's, ready. it's about to go down. <laughs> I was beating, man. And by the way, stay tuned on the channel because I've got a video where I've invested um, a, a huge sum of money into trading 212 and you guys will see it. So click on open. Click on open. So I'll go through everything um, with you guys and you guys will be able to see. So basically right now, what AB has in front of him, you see it, share, it says, sorry, practice um, with the virtual money. So that's what I was talking about, where you can just practice with fake money, basically, right? It gives you fake money. You can practice this, this way. There's no risk um, or you, you're not losing anything. It's fake money that you're practicing buying real stocks. OK, um, and then you can see it says open an account um, or login. So if you've got an account already, you can log in. But obviously he hasn't got an account and he's about to open up an ISA account, which I can't open because I'll tell you guys more about ISAs. Um, later on, but I can't open because you can't have more than one ISA anyways mm. um, uh, So if you didn't know you know it might be in some of your questions, yeah, but you can't have was. it was yeah, yeah. <laughs> So you can't have more than one ISA um, oh, okay. account um, You can only ISA. yeah, so you know you, you just need one to get started, but if you click on open account, open account. so um, it's pretty self-explanatory. This whole process is gonna take you um, a couple of seconds. All you're gonna need to have is your national insurance. You're gonna need that, um, as well as filling in other questions that you guys are gonna see right now. So um, you click on, uh, um, what did you click on, the UK? So yeah, wherever you, UK, wherever, mm -hmm. wherever your country is, so wherever you're staying at, so UK, mm -hmm. yeah? And then it says name as written as in your in passport, passport, all right? So this is where he will fill it in and this is where um, I will remove it from the screen. So fill that in. Um, whilst he fills it in, um, uh, we'll yeah, you, did you yeah, have a nah, question? A, a question just popped up in my head like, yeah. so as I'm doing this, um, what, what shares can I possibly gain? Like, uh, so yeah, good question. So as, as he's doing this, I'll answer him. Um, you can get basically any share okay the app or the company um will decide on what share that you get so meaning it could be any share up oh. to 100 pounds <laughs> up to 100 pounds. so oh i'm very gosh. excited um don't skip um, oh, all of it through because i want to tell you so right now it's asking him for his date of date birth of um uh, remove it remove it because i want to show them on the screen so each step you just show and then I'll let you yeah, fill yeah. it in because obviously uh, we're not going to be exposing his actual details, all of his real details um, to you guys on the internet. It doesn't make sense. So at this step right now, they asked him for his date of birth so which we can see you guys would do right there. So that, was that the next step, right? Uh, yeah, that was the so next stage. The next stage, it will be your date of birth, which you which you then have okay. to fill in. So I'll remove that, go ahead and fill that in. Mm -hmm. Um, which all of you guys, you've got date of birth. I'm, I'm very sure of that. So you fill in your date of birth. Bear in mind though, you do need to be 18. So what's the next step? The next uh, step is asking number. him for a phone number, yeah. which it already have the, your, whatever the code is for your country. So it has, in this case, it has plus four, four, and then you enter in your phone number. So yeah. go ahead and do that. 
um, right now. Um, uh, and then, yeah, so you need to be 18 plus um, to be able to do that. So the next step is asking AB, it is country where you pay your taxes. So in this case, it will be the UK. UK. Um, so we're in the UK, so just press UK. UK. Yep, yeah, and then does it have, I am a, a tax resident for more than one country. No, you're not um, for more than one country. So you'll just click just next click, on the yeah. UK. Okay, so what is it asking you now? Oh, national so insurance your national number. insurance number. Do you have your national insurance? Um, don't, yeah. don't say yeah, it out. Yeah. Do you have it? <laughs> I have it laying around somewhere. Okay, yeah. so enter it right now then. Um, as he enters that, um, uh, I'm going through. So as you guys can see, it's simple. Okay, and we're literally going through it right now live. So meaning you can literally pause the video and go through the national mm. insurance number um, right now. So, okay, um, so the, the details to make sure you have in hand is they shouldn't ask for your passport. Back in the days, they did used to ask for like passport and, and stuff to do with your passport. But nowadays, uh, I remember when I did it, all it took was my national insurance number and then I just typed it in. Okay, and then it took me to the next stage and um, everything else that it, you know, that, that it, it needs to take you. Um, so AB had an interesting question that he wanted to ask, which you said, um, um, what was yeah. your question? So um, as we're doing this process today and I'm, I'm applying for a free share, like how, how long will it take to come? Um, so if you get, if you do, if you, by clicking the link in the description, like I'm telling you guys to claim your free share, um, and everything, it takes a business day. So one business day, um, and then you get whatever share that they're, they're, they're going to give oh, you. It could be 80, oh yeah, it could be 88 gosh. pounds, 19 pounds, um, uh, Bank of America. It could be McDonald's. It could be <laughs> Nike. Um, I haven't seen a Nike one yet, um, but it could be any of that. So, which is, um, fairly interesting. So what stage are you now? So the next stage, um, I can um, see is it residential address, residential address. So this is when I'll ask you for your address. Um, and then you just enter in your address like AB is about to do now. So go ahead and do that. Um, Find but yeah, so address. wherever you live, I believe, um, trading 212 is in, also in Germany, Australia, um, if I haven't forgotten, I mean, you can always double check that on the internet, um, but you should be able to trade from anywhere. Okay, Absolutely. so you've gone past the address, yeah? Yep. So he's gone past the address. The next stage is showing him is to choose your account type. Mm. So now, guys, on this um, part or this stage, um, it's showing us you can choose a normal CDF, sorry, CFD, sorry, account, um, which it tells you right there, as you guys can see on the screen, it says active trading with leverage and uh, zero commission stocks, Forex, cryptos and all of that um, stuff. Now, as a tip, I stay away from this. OK, this is where you can lose your money. In fact, in trading 212, um, they, they, they tell you themselves that. This is where, <laughs> which is funny, but it says 76% of people <clears throat> on the platform lose their money through um, wow. C, um, CFD. Okay, so you want to stay away from that. So you want to untick that first untick one. That, yeah. um, wait for it. I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you people on the on, the, um, on your screen as oh, well. Oh, it even came up. Yeah. So untick it. Did it come up? Yeah. Did it untick it. Oh, it's gone. But yeah. Did it go? Okay, what did they say? It said 76%, like you said, so, like people I, lose. I've done my research, guys. 76% of people lose their money with that. And you know what? I love a company that's honest, mm, okay? A company true. that tells you up front, and it's not like we're trying to hide it, like, you know, we, we want you to lose your... No, 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 no. They're telling you up front, so which is a good, uh, once more, a good thing um, as well. So you want to definitely make sure, as I mentioned, you untick that. So the top one is unticked. unticked. So... Um, ISA is what we're going to be opening up, which will give you, it says it right there. So free investing in um, real stocks, right? And ETFs, zero commission, zero fees. Okay. Um, um, which is ETFs is, we're going to get into that a bit later on, but that's exactly what we're seeking for. Yeah. And then what's the bottom one say? Um, the bottom one says, yeah, the, no, the, the middle one says uh, free investing, just a normal investing. Yeah, 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 which we're choosing. But the, the, last, the one, last one is uh, ISA. Invest tax free in a zero commission stocks and shares ISA. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So, um, the sorry, no, no, no. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I, I got it twisted around. So we're gonna be going for the ISA, which is the this bottom one, one right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see it properly. So ISA is the bottom one, which we're going to be opening. The middle one is an invest one, um, which we're not going to be opening right now, but we can open at any time. So if you click on the ISA one, 
the bottom one, yeah? So yeah, I, yeah. I should untick. Untick, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah. The, that one unticked. Unticked. And the last one ticked. Uh, yeah, the, just to, to make sure you didn't tick the top one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. We want that crypto. Man. Yeah, we don't want that crypto. We don't want no potential of losing money. So okay. um, we're going with the ISO one. So if you click next. Next. Okay, so this is where it's going to ask you your questions, which I'll, I'll remove and then you'll fill yeah. up. So it's asking you your annual income. Mm -hmm. Do you earn over 150,000, um, 75,000, um, uh, um, um, and um, uh, 149,000, 25,074, um, 15 to 24 um, or under? So mm -hmm. this is where you choose whatever answer um, that you want to choose. One other thing that I love as well that is absolutely amazing with trading 212 mm -hmm. is it tells you because questions might get a bit hmm, a bit suspicious like why, why are they asking <laughs> why are they asking bare questions or True. why are they asking too many questions right um the thing i love about it is it tells you why they're asking these questions so if you click on uh, why, so we ask about why we ask about it, it explains to you exactly why they're asking you all of these questions that might seem a bit too you know personal if you get what i mean mm. but you know um you answer it accordingly so ab if you can go ahead and answer um whatever it is and then you can go to the next page. So we are now at the next page. What is it saying? Source of deposit. So this is asking you where is your um, deposit going to come from? Is it coming from your salary? Um, is it from savings, pension or social benefits? Yeah. Um, is it um, a return of investment? So meaning yeah. did you invest some money and then you made some money yeah. and now you're reinvesting the money? Mm, okay. Yeah. Or is it an inheritance, meaning okay. like a loved one oh, maybe passed more. away? Damn. There's, there's a lot more um, uh, that we that you, you know that we yeah. know for. So if you choose your answer right now, okay. Uh, so you guys will do the exact same. You'll choose your answer right now as well, and um, you go through it this way. We go through it step by step. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling quite excited because uh -huh. just one step closer to wait. officially investing. So, I so can see the green bar getting closer. And it's closer getting closer and closer. So what is this question now? So it's asking you whether you're um, um, what is your employment status? Are you employed? Are you in student? unemployed retired or self-employed once more ab go ahead and answer um okay. uh, your 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 designated question i feel like it's like gcse's test Literally. like is and then you're answering it so you know next step um so the next step is saying occupation so you just answer whatever you do as as a job, as a job so yeah so okay. you just answer it okay so ab just entered in exactly um what he does um for his day job um which you press next and then we'll see what the next stage is Woo! so press next now. yeah yeah let's next. see if it's opening our account Ooh. so why is it asking what is um the industry of the or the nature of the business of you know where oh, you're working well, at so okay. ab wants more we'll fill that in um and then so as for this stage for ab it's retail obviously you guys saw it on the previous screen so if you click next let's see if it's next. the final one to open up Ooh, one more okay so this is where you need to make sure you read okay talk about reading the fine prints all right um this is where you need to make sure basically you read everything and um especially if you're new to it all right if, if it's your first time so you'll go through i'll let ab read absolutely everything as well um uh, right now obviously i'm not going to bore you guys and and make you watch him read every single one but i'll, I'll obviously skip it to when he does uh, read every single one and then i believe the final one is to confirm as you guys can see on the button there and then it would basically finish up finish everything. everything okay so i'll let ab read it right okay so ab has read everything um uh, and uh, you know it did take a while didn't it yeah, so yeah, yeah. but you want to make sure you read and you know what you're signing up for um as i mentioned um it's it's something that pff, uh, last time i saw it was 14 million users they have um actively trading and using the account so you know i can i can safely say there's nothing to worry about in that regards so um the final step that ab is at now is i guess yeah, just to click confirm, confirm which will officially create your officially account. officially and wait before i click this i confirm yeah um, so as of now there's no commission no nothing no no fees that i have to pay at all there's zero fees um trading 212 is absolutely a, i don't know maybe trading 212 might even be watching this video right now so <laughs> if you are i'm not affiliated by them uh whatsoever all i have is in a, the, the link in the description is the link to be able to allow you guys to get the free share just like we just done with ab um uh, and this way you'll be able to get the free share if you just normally sign up you ain't getting no free share okay so if trading 212 is watching right now maybe you know you know hit, hit up your boy and um maybe we can do some business uh 
um, or become, I don't know, an actual affiliate because it seems like a good platform. But right now, the stage that AB um, is at and the question that he mentioned is absolutely completely zero no commission to pay just trade and um do what you're good at or mm. what you want to become good at mm. eventually so just trade and get on with it okay they don't need to they don't need to give you any hidden fees no, or whatever it is so uh you ready to press that confirm yeah, button i'm ready i'm ready <clears throat> all right so let's let's get this money i confirm, confirm. oh there's <laughs> okay so there's one there's one more step if you're watching i hope this is interesting so what is it asking for your um, email email and uh, and to create a password, password. Yeah. so this is where ab will write his email and um he'll create a password um for his thing so go ahead and start doing that if you've got a password in mind as well go ahead and do that as well so what he's doing that as i mentioned is simple as simple can be the good thing i love about this is ab's got some juicy questions that he's asking as we're doing this and i'm answering because these are some questions that i had yeah. when i got started and um i know you guys have as well and i'm sure it just seems daunting like trading yeah, i yeah, trade exactly. like you're just like what the heck does he do you see what i mean so i i really do appreciate it, the way you're asking the questions as well it's making it more interesting and um yeah. you know and maybe if you've got a, a good idea that you want to mention yeah. um uh, you know let it be above my head right there there's that light bulb a good idea that, that you might want to mention whilst we're on camera then by all means just fire out the questions yeah, yeah, at me we'll and do. um i'll be we'll able to do. answer what i can yeah okay so um you filled it in um and um uh, yeah so create ready. i guess the final step is click create, create account. account yep uh, click it when you're ready wait sorry let, oh, let me God. just double check on my password because okay i feel like because i don't want to reveal his password so that's why i moved away from the screen so redo yeah, it yeah, yeah. You don't, I've, I've memorized it you've memorized it right yeah, yeah, yeah. so as you press confirm that's what i'm going to switch the screen so they can see okay. the, the whole cre creating three two, two one go Okay, oh, it's recreating, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading. Okay, it's taking a while. But let's see, is it? It's, it's still taking a while. It Once is. we put. There we are. Okay, so there we are. It's asking him allow. for notification. Allow, of course, you want to be um, up to scratch with everything. Um, so verify your identity so this part is asking him to verify his identity and everything else so which um, let me show them as well um, which you might have to do as an additional step mm -hmm. so let's see so it's asking him um, to verify his identity use a device such as blah blah which will go through you just select which one you want to use okay so we'll do that right now okay so for that step um it's showing up you don't actually have to do that um final step you can skip it and do it later on which you ended up skipping it to do it later on so you guys are completely up to date let me show you what it's showing ab uh, on his screen so he is in okay he is in the building um on the actual app itself and um, i'm just going to give it a quick tour mm -hmm. obviously this is a beginner's video so i'm going to give it a quick tour so you get exactly what's going on and understand okay so you can you can see um and whatever i've talked about just point to it ab so that yeah. they can see on the screen as well um so there's your watch list at the top most of the millennials are obviously this is going to be self-explanatory because it's just it's, it's a basic app and, and they make it very very incredibly user friendly so you've got home at the bottom you guys can see that right there um which where we are at the home page it shows you all of the watch lists so on your watch list these are stocks that you might want to watch okay and observe and see are they going up in price yeah. are they dropping in price do I want to buy into the stocks, yeah. um, you know, and things of that nature? Do you get, do you get what yeah. I mean? And this yeah? is happening right now. Live, live, live as live can be, Damn. okay? Um, there might be a slight delay yeah. um, uh, because if we're using, for example, when you buy a stock, this is, this is just ad additional information, right? You don't have to get too wind up on this, but like if you buy a stock right now, um because it has to go through all of the procedures isn't yeah, it yeah. To, and then finally to get executed at vanguard so for example okay. if you bought vanguard um there's a slight delay like the slightest bit of delay so yeah. but it's real time as real can be if that makes sense yeah i just wanted to say that just as an additional step but it's nothing to um uh, you know to 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 worry about or to be concerned about yeah. it's just advanced information so um yeah you're in so if you wanted to buy tesla right now uh, which i can show them if you wanted to buy tesla right now if you click, click on, on tesla yeah and it will it will basically be buy so you'd have to click on buy 
all right um but at the bottom as you guys can see if you scroll through right which i'll show you actually you can observe from there which will be easier mm -hmm. so right now it shows company details okay you guys can clearly see it you can read a bit about the company um if we press that button right here you press that little arrow you can read a bit about the company if you didn't know who tesla was which the majority <laughs> of people guess what you know who tesla is um so um you can read a bit about the company um and um and then you have at the top right here, which you guys can see, it tells you who is the CEO of the company, which in this case is Elon, Elon Musk. Musk. Okay, 48,000 employees. Oh my gosh. Absolutely insane. 48,000 employees, as you guys can see. Okay, um, it tells you where the headquarters is, um, the sectors. You can see all this is just additional information. Mm. So, and, and then at the bottom, you can see it's telling you the key um, ratios, the market cap at 391 billion with a capital b <laughs> um and then uh, pe ratio is not showing um but that's pe ratio stands for profit to earning ratio okay. if i haven't forgotten uh correct me if i'm wrong in the comments but i'm quite sure i am not wrong um uh, because i've done my homework but yeah so that's that and then the revenue um 24 billion as we can see um and then this one 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 place to pay attention at guys it's you see where it says dividend yield mm. i want you to pay attention to that because that means tesla doesn't actually pay you dividends okay you can earn the stock you can buy it and if your stock goes up in value or it appreciates in value you make the difference as a profit but tesla doesn't actually pay you dividends mm. So they don't pay you money per, mm, mm. per whatever it is. Yeah. Okay, which I'm sure it might match with some yeah, of the questions you have. Yeah, it matches with one of the questions. What I was the question ask. you had? It was, um, there was, so there's two different portfolios <clears throat> when I was watching on YouTube, someone mentioned, and uh -huh. they said, uh, like, strategies of um, growth portfolio and um, dividends portfolio. But I was I was a bit confused. Like, I don't know what those, those terms mean or how to use it. Or And you're keeping track of your questions, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So okay. um, that question, you say tra tra strategies of um, a growth portfolio. Yeah, or growth portfolio or dividends portfolio. So the growth portfolio is basically such as this an example. So if we use Tesla because we're already on here, yeah? Mm -hmm. um, if, if, if it was a growth strategy, mm -hmm. it would mean that you are buying into Tesla mm -hmm. And knowing that, okay, guys, so I just wanted to double check and make sure that Tesla, um, they, as I mentioned, they don't pay any dividends yield, as you can see right there. So I just triple check because I don't like telling people like false information or whatever it is um, that, yeah. So they don't, as I mentioned, and then with a the question that AB asked me about, what was it growth, um, growth portfolio, growth and portfolio, dividends and, portfolio and dividend yeah. portfolio and, and whatnot. So growth uh, meaning you basically buy, um, such as Tesla, like I was saying, right? They don't pay any dividends, but you buy in the hopes that it will go up. Okay. Okay. So it will go up and you make some money from that. Mm -hmm. And then you build a portfolio around stocks that don't necessarily pay you dividends, mm -hmm. but you're hoping for them to Grow. to exactly mm -hmm. and appreciate in value. And then this way you make some money, if mm -hmm. you get what I yeah, mean. Yeah, yeah. Um, whereas the other one that you asked was a dividend, dividend, was portfolio, it? Yeah. A dividend portfolio being basically a portfolio that consists of um, uh, ETFs, all right? Um, uh, uh, ex um, uh, electronically exchange, ex uh, exchanged um, um, uh, funds mm -hmm. and um, basically they don't um, they they pay you dividends yeah but you you more so you more of look forward towards like being paid um, uh, either uh, monthly okay yeah dividends this is yeah, yeah. Uh, monthly um, uh, quarterly that answers my other yeah. question. <laughs> yeah, quarterly or um, uh, annually. Okay. So they can pay out dividends per annual. So me per annum. So meaning if you earned maybe a share from McDonald's, mm -hmm. we all love good old McDee's. Um, uh, so if you own maybe McDonald's, then um, they'll pay you back um, dividends every single year. Okay. Once a year, they send out a paycheck which comes through to you. And, um, uh, you know, happy mm -hmm. days. And then this way you can pull out money from your you can build a portfolio, a large portfolio of dividends yeah. um, that pay you and you live off that basically okay. eventually if you build it big enough. And is it like the more you invest, the more the bigger dividends you get back or? Yeah, um, um, essentially. So the more you have invested in the market, considering the market is doing yeah. well, um, but 
But with dividends, they pay you basically just for for holding the share. So basically, for earning the share, you get mm. paid for it. Okay. If that company pays dividends, yeah. such as when we saw Tesla didn't, so obviously you won't be getting any dividends. Oh, I've just received from confirmation Tesla. emails. <laughs> Did you actually? Yeah, so yeah. So he's just received some confirmation emails, um, uh, which we can quickly glance right there. The top there. Um, on the top right there of you know you don't have oh, to open. Oh yeah. But yeah, it is telling him basically just you know to to. Um, so just as confirmation, it's literally basically. legit. Like, it's no yeah, joke. It's, it's and not, another one, just, another one just came right Another now. one just came up. Um, people, um, people say that, um, it's that people sort of, I don't know why I get this question sometimes. Like, is trading 212 fake? Is it a scam? Is, is it, right. trust me, far from being a scam, um, they're, they're FCA regulated as well. And um, uh, yeah, so your money is protected up to eighty-five thousand pounds, which mm. is exactly what your normal banks, such as Barclays, uh, Metro Bank, um, uh, Monzo, all of your banks, they've got all of that um, uh, sort of uh, you know certificates and um, uh, you know guarantee that you won't just they won't just pick up and go and then you've lost you all will, your money. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, I don't know if you had uh, further questions. Now nah, um, you ticked off um, the question of how how often do you get paid dividends, mm -hmm. which I was like thinking like, oh, is it once a year or every two years? Mm -hmm. But that like you said you mentioned it's one month, or quarterly, or full year. Or full, uh, yeah, exactly. Which is which is good. And um, you mentioned something about FCA, FCA covered or something like that. Uh, yeah. So I did mention something about. So yeah, AB just re-asked on that. As I mentioned, yeah. eighty-five grand um, with the. F yeah, FCA and then F. The other one is FCSC. Comment yeah. in the comment section down below if if I'm losing my mind right now. But it's basically like I was telling you, all of the banks are um, all of the money in your bank account is protected and safe up to eighty five thousand. Yeah. So meaning, if the if the bank, which is a business, went out of business, you can get your Hands money down. back. Hands down, Man. you can get your money back. So there's no need to worry about it. Yeah. or anything like that yeah okay so but back uh, into the app um anyways whenever a question comes up if you've got something written down yeah you can go through it we'll do. so yeah so the app itself as i'm showing ab right now his phone i don't know where's the camera yeah his phone is right here um and we're going through it so which we can even use right now like this so yeah so you guys can see there is my finger sliding up and down and i'll just give him like a, a quick tutorial so right now it's showing the market is open hence the why you guys can see open right there the market is open so meaning if you were to buy a a share um it will go through immediately immediately yeah um, there won't be any sort of waiting time or yeah. anything like that Okay, that's a bit about the company. Um, we were where it shows you dividend yield, where it says dividend yield. You don't get any of that with Tesla. All you do basically is own. And then at the bottom, it has a bit more information. You can get into yeah, that. Yeah. It's just information to know um, before investing in um, to the company itself. Okay, on this page as well are the very top top right guys um, where it says 100% battery charge. You can see it has a little clock. That's right there. So basically, you can set this to any price. Damn. All right. So right now, we can see Tesla stock or to buy a share for Tesla is $425. Okay. 36 pence. It keeps fluctuating because it's real time that we're dealing with. Right. So if you're, for example, you're like, you know what? Right now, it's a bit expensive. 425 is too much for me. Mm. I want to set it to let me know when the prices drop below 425 mm, mm, mm. mm. so you might want to set it to drop to let you know when it drops to 400 yeah. on the dot yeah because that's quite low okay mm -hmm, a whole mm. 25 um, dollars off is, is a lot okay and you guys can see it's taking me a while i'm holding down the down arrow to shift it if we wanted to drop all the way which is unlikely by the way not impossible because mm -hmm. You know the stock market anything can. can happen um but you know tesla as i'm sure most of you know or have seen it's growing um oh. so yeah and for wait 425 yeah. it is quite a lot is that the price for um one share or yep and and would that be possible like do i always have to buy one share or can i like for example if i had like 200 and i still wanted to invest in tesla what would i have to do then if you have 200, well, you need more than 200 to invest in Tesla because oh, it's 426 true, 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 true. now. It's changing. Yeah. Um, but you don't have to just buy one share. You can buy basically 
as uh, as much shares um, as you want okay. or as, as you can afford. Okay. Um, but obviously, the way the stock um, market works, the more share people buy, the uh-huh. prices of the shares will uh-huh. go up. Uh-huh. Do you get what I mean? Uh-huh. But as for you, you can buy pretty much as much as Even you can like afford. Even like 0.5 uh, yep. fractions and stuff. Exactly. So um, you mentioned it right. With fractional um, shares, which is a good thing about trading 212 as well, they do something called fractional shares, meaning you can buy half of a share. Oh. Not a whole share, but half of a share. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. Or you can even buy 10p of a share and Damn. you now own... 10p, 10p of, of you know of of um of whatever share it is that okay. you that you purchased so you don't have to buy a full full share if that makes sense yeah yeah but you can set that to 400 set um price alerts so meaning when this drops to 400 it will, it will let you know you might be working out in the gym <laughs> and you hit pink 400 you're like you know what I might want to get in right now because <laughs> it might be my workout <laughs> yeah you might want to stop your workout put a, a, a order through and the thing is you don't even need your card because once you enter your card it saves your card wow. so it makes transferring money you know um, uh, quite easy that way okay so t- talking about card if if we're in home right now I'll show you guys okay so we're on home right now if you click on um, at the top where it says zero zero so zero pounds mm-hmm. yeah if we click on the top right there this is where you'll be able to deposit funds so this is the important part now that we want to do yeah, um, yeah. So basically, I'm going to get you to deposit one uh, pound. One pound, yeah. Just like I told you guys, you're going to be doing is just depositing one pound and then that's it. Okay, and you can get started. So AB is going to deposit one pound right now. I'm going to click deposit funds so you guys can see the next step. You can see orange at the top right there because that's the ISA account. So it's highlighted which account that you're in. Mm-hmm. So if you ever get confused which account you're in, just look at the, which one's highlighted. Okay, you can see CD, CFD is not highlighted, Invest is not highlighted, but ISA is. So now you've got ISA account. Mm-hmm. So you click on Deposit Fund. Okay, it was going to take you to the next step, and then I'm going to get him to do um, everything. So this is where clearly you're showing. We skipped it last time, like I told you guys in the, on the camera. Um, but um, in in order for him, I believe maybe because he's 18, um, is asking for um, you know additional stuff such as like your ID and stuff like that or your face. So, but once we get past that, we should be able to deposit the funds. If not, then obviously I'll let you guys know as well. Um, but yeah, so we're about to do that right now, AB. Okay, guys. So we've just gone through and done it. It asked you, uh, what did it ask you? you? I'll let you explain um, um, to, yeah, to get to the stage. You had to like upload um, either your pass passport a driving license or any sort of like confirmation that it's actually you mm-hmm. and then um the second one was just take a selfie like i thought it was gonna take long but mm. just said yeah take a selfie um it's in the shape of a face already so don't worry about your background uh-huh. make sure the lighting is good and literally that's all done it, it all finished mm. that's nice so this is the screen that it then took him to after it asked you to take a picture uh-huh. um and then ask him to take the back of uh, the driving license as well oh yeah, yeah yeah um so the front and back of the driving license then it asked you to take a selfie so it matches your face from the um, driving license mm-hmm. and um it did that literally in uh, what i'll say a couple of seconds a couple of seconds literally maximum nine eight seconds um and then it took him to this page so this page you can clearly see it says zero commission um on trading real stocks and et no maintenance charges um no inactive fees so meaning basically you can leave this for <laughs> years and and go about your day um you're Sorry. not going to incur any fees because you've been inactive or whatever it is um or any other hidden fees that's the important fun- uh, factor right there because i told you a lot of um companies they're not honest about that but you've mm. clearly seen it right there it says no hidden fees okay and we've got this on recording right now so you can use that um but yeah it's right there and then uh, the last one it says direct execution on uh, the exchanges so um uh, which is wonderful we always want that to take place so if we press continue continue okay fund your, fund your account press deposit funds okay and this is where you choose which method you want to use if you if you connect your bank it will say it says it right there all deposit methods um are without fees which is good so you don't get charged for that and then you select your type method um your method type bank transfer you can do if you wire that out you can go in and out very quickly it just makes life a lot easier for you credit card debit card you can do the exact same thing easier for you apple pay and skrill um so but we're obviously going to be using a debit card so we're going to fund it with a debit card and i'll let um ab click that on debit card okay and then it lets you it it asks you basically how much do you want to fund the account with okay a thousand 
Um, by the way, by default, you guys saw on camera, by default, it selected um, a thousand, oh, yeah. but you obviously don't have to put a thousand in. I mentioned one pound, so just drag it back to one pound. I want to see what the limit is. Literally. Ooh, 20, oh yeah. 20 grand. 20 because grand. it's an ISO, yeah, remember? Yeah. So um, I'm glad that you dragged it there. So that's the limit you can put in a th uh, 20 grand um, for an ISO, as you guys saw, but a pound, that's all you need for a free share okay so um a pound he's going to deposit i confirm you, you have to select the bottom uh, so you can yeah, set yeah. by the yeah you so you can set reoccurring so meaning you can basically have it which is um uh, which is clever yeah. um but you can have it take money out of your account every month okay um for investing so you can set an Genius. amount and say you know what every month i think i can dedicate 30 pounds 50 40 100 okay, to investing and it's going to withdraw that into your from your account and drop it in there this way at the beginning of the month uh, with especially with people who can't manage or they're not so well yeah, they don't do yeah. so well with managing mm. you can um already set a designated amount that comes off straight away straight so you, away. so you don't see it in your yeah. account so it doesn't mess mess you up you're like oh yeah. i'm losing out on like 100 mm -hmm. pounds so it does that straight away so you can set that but in this case one pound tick okay. the box mm -hmm. That's confirm. take it confirm um and then click next and then it's going to ask for your details so this is where he'll enter his details and then we'll get back to you guys so right now ab just entered in all of his details using his monzo um card if you don't bank with monzo then i don't know what you're doing because they're absolutely awesome we talk a lot about it on the channel as well but that is ab's card so he just done that right now and then um, we're going to go through the next step so he pressed next and then they asked him to go into his monzo because he paid with monzo as i showed you guys to confirm the one pound transaction um i'm guessing often because I, I worked in like um uh, in a, a virgin money bank often with one pound transaction um companies or banks can s potentially see them maybe a suspicious uh, number because who transfers one pound <laughs> do you get what i mean yeah. it's very unlikely um for someone to be transferring one pound so it just asks for additional proof or um you know security to confirm yeah which is exactly what is done for ab right there so he's about to confirm it right now um and then we'll get to the next thing so you can see account successfully funded um one pound trading one two one two um account successfully funded and um yeah so and then what you would do is you just click okay so you can clearly see at the top it's showing that ab now has one pound that is in monzo this will automatically trigger the free share um as well which will come through in one um business day that's when it's going to land onto okay. your account um so don't be afraid if it go if it doesn't go through instantly um because i remember the first ever time i did it i didn't see my free share automatically <laughs> i was like hold on nah where's my free yeah. share and, and i started asking all sorts of questions so if you go to the second tab get free shares okay so this is popping up now for ab it popped up automatically it's showing um get free shares worth up to 100 pounds just like i mentioned to you guys in the beginning um so this is for you to use the link okay. to share to your friends and then you can get 20 free shares Damn. um up to uh, 20 free shares all worth over 100 pounds or 100 pounds mm -hmm. okay so you just click close close it close it yep 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 so he's closed it and then if now you click on the next tab along at the bottom so if i take if i take over and you can just watch and we'll show um everyone else as well so um right there as i mentioned all of these steps when you do it super quick it doesn't take mega long whatsoever um uh, but we wanted to do step by step for the very beginners just like uh, mm -hmm. ab is going through right now who have no clue and we've answered some of the amazing questions um that he's had as well okay so the next um section or oh, right at the top in fact um we've got the watch list we've got the top winners okay um we've got top losers <laughs> um usually with investing you want to jump in when things are very low True. because it means they're discounted yep. so you're not really looking for the winners you're looking for the losers honestly speaking um popular stocks u.s stocks uk stocks you can see all of that uh, at the top new to trading 212 sorry i clicked on barclays by accident new to trading 212 and then you've got etfs etfs is where exactly we're going to be dwelling at that's the good the sweet spot to be dwelling at mm. because etfs um you can see vanguard s p 500 and all of that stuff right you can as you can see right there but this is basically um where you want to be in a sense of this is what's going to allow you to diversify your portfolio meaning you are invested in a lot of companies at once 
Okay. okay. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. Uh, literally a lot of companies all at once at, this, oh at the same gosh. time. So it's going to give you, you know, good flexibility, meaning it's, it's less likely for you to lose your money. Okay. Rather than you investing into individual, um, individual stocks, if I got the top where my watch, um, my, my watch list is. So rather than you investing only in Apple, I'll show you guys as well on the screen. Rather than you only investing in Apple, mm. as you can see right now, mm -hmm. you can, um, in fact, go and ETFs right there. Okay, and invest in something like the S&P 500, F, uh, Vanguard, um, FTSE, mm. um, FTSE, FTSE, <laughs> um, as well as Vanguard, um, you know, basically there's different S&P 5, um, sorry, not S&P 500, there's different um, ETFs mm. that cover like, uh, you know, yeah, every, every, everywhere else okay. basically. Um, and um, yeah, so you can, you can look into investing into retails and uh, they're basically there's just a ton. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. yeah? So that's that section. The next tab along at the bottom um, is where you'll be getting your, you, it says get, get your free shares, shares, but that will, should trigger the, there we go. It should trigger that link for you to then share automatically. If you click on it to be able to share to your friends okay. and every, and everyone else. Okay. Um, it shows your ISA utilization, which we've only got one pound. Mm -hmm. You've got 19,999 left, left Damn. for the year to max out your ISA. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you want to max out your ISA, um, uh, which if you can, if you're fortunate enough to have the funds to be able to do so, mm -hmm. go ahead because it's tax free money, okay, tax -free. that and, you can invest. And yeah? I noticed how you said um, year, is it from the exact time that you open the account to the next year or is it like a specific? No, thing? no, no. So it's not like because you open the account um, today, then it's, it's like um, uh, because what we're in, um, what's today's month? September. Oh, uh, yeah, isn't September. It? Yeah. And it means that it doesn't mean that next September 2021, that's your full one year. Oh, no. no, it's full financial year. So okay. financial year where, where you have to pay your tax and stuff like that. Um, uh, so which it will be April, this round about the 6th of April um, for the UK. That's when, well, it says it even here, what I'm on about, I've just, I've just literally seen it. It says it here, actually. I'll show you guys. It says mm -hmm. it here at the bottom. It says before um, the 6th of April 2021. Okay, um, so you've got one pound in and 20 grand out of 20 grand. All mm -hmm. right, if you want to deposit more funds, you go ahead and click so and do so. All right, but um, yes, yeah, so we don't want to get too much into that. This is if you want to auto invest, it can create an auto investment pie for you. We're not going to do that right now, but where it just automatically invests for you, which is pretty cool. Um, I believe it's a new feature that's just been added. Okay, this, the search, you can search for any company. You can click the most uh, popular companies, dividend, um, growth, and basically just search ETFs, um, are pretty much self-explanatory and there's quite a lot um, uh, to go through. That'll be for another video, okay? Um, uh, down here, you can watch videos. This will be videos mainly geared towards trading 212, um, uh, um, sorry, trading 212 CFD to like, you know, little tutorials and stuff yeah. like that, um, which we're not obviously gonna watch right now. And then there's video, sorry, not videos, uh, economic calendar, price alerts, history, uh, notifications, settings, all of that amazing stuff that you guys can see. And you can also get in contact with them 24 seven. Um. And you can also get on the phone with them as well. Um, a free trade, I believe doesn't have the phone, uh, um, uh, option, but you can get on the phone with them if you've got anything question, yeah. uh, any questions or anything that you're like, oh, what's going on here? So you can get in touch with them um, as well. Okay, about us and deposit funds, or switch to a practice fund so you can um, practice account. Practice sorry, mm. a practice account so you can go ahead and practice. Mm, okay. Okay. So what we're gonna do right now is we're actually going to buy. Okay, we're actually going to buy, um, which um, if it takes a while, then I'm going to edit it out yeah. for you guys. But I'm going to let AB decide what he wants to invest with the one pound yeah. that he puts. And then obviously um, he's going to get receive the free um, fund and then we'll show you guys as well. So AB has decided um, <laughs> what share or what share he wants to buy, mm -hmm. um, which company, what exactly to do. I'm quite sure if you've been paying attention to what I've been talking about, in this video, you're gonna know most likely what he's going to um, go ahead and go with. So, let's see what he decides to go with. So, um, I'm gonna see if he if he remembers as I was talking. If he was a good student, if he was listening. So, how would you get to ETFs? 
So yeah, so I'm currently from the top bit. It's yep. on my watch list. So which is at home? Uh huh. I just slide it all the way to the right. Uh huh. ETF. Yep, yep, yep. And I see all the list of all the ETFs. Yep. And then um, S and P 500 Vanguard. Yep. I wanted to buy it. Okay. Um, so pause right there. So as you guys saw, he wants to buy S and P 500 Vanguard. Why? Um. Why would you? Why did? You, why do you want to get that? Oh, because as you mentioned, like um, it's it's safe. Because mm-hmm. it's investing your money in 500 of the leading, you know, um, businesses and um, and yeah, businesses in uh, I think America. Did you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah America. So it's it's really safe and um, it doesn't try beat the market. It just follows it. Mm-hmm. Okay. So yep, go ahead and um, spend your full one pound. Ninety nine p. Press buy. Review order. There we go. So this is the exact page that I wanted to pop up. So as you guys will be able to see, it says you can't place a single order worth more than 95% of your free funds. So what happens here is, um, um, a because I wanted I wanted you to I wanted yeah. that to come up so you can see or remember the the, the, the lesson or whatever it is that I'm trying to teach you. So basically, um, uh, coming uh, to the show a bit more. Yeah, there we go. So basically, um. If even if you have 20 grand um, uh, inside this ISA account, you yeah. can't spend at once, by the way, only at once. You can't spend like 95% of the uh, account um, overall balance at once. You can buy once and then straight away, instantly buy again. Mm-hmm. There's no problem with that, but you just can't do it all at, uh, at, once. All at once. So yeah, it's just broken up into like that. Do you get what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So um, if we go back into it, then close. yep, close. Yeah, so just reduce it down a bit. Um, uh, I would say round about, yeah, round about something like that. Mm-hmm. That should be okay. Um, so he's buying 0.017% um, percent of, um, you know, the S&P 500. So place your order. Okay, your order must be at least, sorry, um, your, your order must be at least one pound. So as um, for the ones who were listening, you realize that I mentioned um, you can't spend because we came across that because you can't spend a hundred percent of what's in your account, even if it's one pound or whatever it is. Um, uh, so basically, all we had to do was just add a couple of pennies, so we're not spending um, over ninety-five percent of what's mm-hmm. in the account, um, which we've um, done so. So you just fund your account as normal. If you wanted to spend, you know, the the one pound. Yeah, you um, could. So yeah, so um, I'll show you guys right now. So AB went ahead and just added um, a tiny bit more money into his account um, to be able to actually buy because what, oh yeah, what you guys, you do not have to buy um, a share for you to get your free share. It's just gonna come in that one business day that I mentioned. Oh, one business day. Yeah, yeah. So, but AB obviously wants to invest in his first share, yeah. um, whatever. So he's going ahead and hence to why he funded a bit, the account with like a couple of pennies more or pounds more. Yeah. yeah so go ahead um you want to see how, how much is a how much the whole share a whole, whole one share. a whole share if you do want to add a whole share you can fund it but to to own a whole share it'll be 49 pounds oh 42. damn so just to show me how much i can possibly fund with the yeah below oh, 95 gosh percent. Yeah, yeah gosh all right i think i'm just gonna um Half it, maybe twenty. Yeah, yeah. Twenty. Twenty. Let me try to find twenty. Oh, can I can I switch it to? Yeah, go ahead. Value. So he's getting the hang of this already. It's it's pretty easy. So when you switch to value, you now switch to money. So you can see how many pounds, yeah. how many you know, how much it is. So twenty pounds, which will get you zero point four oh four units. Okay. Um, of the S&P 500. So click on review order. Let's see what it says. It should be fine. There we go. It's fine. This is basically your final check before it sends it off and you're actually in the market. Um, Because because the, the video has been obviously longer than before, so I'm not sure if the market is still open, but it should be, if I'm not mistaken, um, right now. So the final step is just to click send by, by order, order. Yeah, and then it will, it will execute it. Uh, market is closed. Yep. So right now, what it's good that it's closed anyways. So it will buy it first thing in the morning, um, but what it will do is it will block off it will block off that money, um, so that fund isn't available basically. So yeah, so you will see right there, 
Do you see it? It says um, blocked twenty pending. blocked blocked for pending orders twenty pounds. Okay, so he funded his, his account as you guys can see by a, a couple of uh, pounds, and now um, he's used twenty pounds. He's got twenty one. Uh, sorry, one pounds free funds left of his own money that he's funded, um, and it's been blocked off to execute that order. Damn. Okay, so which will come through. So as for the free share itself, it comes through in one business day. Um, as we mentioned, and then you get your free share right then. If you don't, I'll let you know what to do. So if I'll take over the phone right mm -hmm. now. If for whatever reason you don't receive your free share, which hasn't happened ever in like whatever, how, however many years, um, but this is all, you, all you're gonna do is you go to the free lines that you see right there. You go to help basically. Um, or contact us, sorry, and then you just get in contact with them and then you explain. Everything else is self-explanatory, okay? So the contact form is there. You send, I didn't receive my, my bloody uh, yeah. blah, 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 one share. Um, I need um, clarification. Majority of the time is just because you're being impatient because it hasn't come through yet. It will come through and then you'll know the exact share that you've exact got, um, that you know, that you've been able to accumulate. Yeah. Okay, so AB had a final few, uh, some or some final few questions that he did want to ask, yeah. um, uh, um, such as, I guess. So yeah, no, nah, my, 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 well, two questions were, but the first one is, um, if I'm someone who uses Moneybox to like invest and try uh build money from it and stuff like that would you advise me getting the money i've put into money box because money box it doesn't have the s p 500 it doesn't have many um you know business businesses on it yeah so would you advise me taking all the money out there and uh, putting it into trading 212 uh particularly s p 500 <laughs> yeah um, <laughs> yeah um honestly speaking i would i mean it depends on you as an individual what plans you have mm. um but as you clearly saw there is an overwhelming amount of um uh, you know companies or yeah. businesses yeah. um that you can invest in on trading 212 um a huge platform they've been around for a while over 14 million users so you know um just because you've got i've got more of a a variety yeah yeah of um stocks to choose from so rather than allow my money to just sit there mm. i might as well put it to good use um because let's not let's not forget the more you invest the more potentially you have of making mm -hmm. um within the stock market so mm -hmm. you know um i i would i would personally Definitely. anyways okay mm -hmm. yeah and um secondly i was yep. thinking um maybe for like the younger ones who are saying oh i'm still not 18 yet or i'm 16 i'm 17 i'm 15 so what would you advise them doing if they really wanted to um inv invest real money into trading two on two end i would say um if they wanted to invest real money the best thing um would literally be to smash the like button um uh, right now if you found first of all if you're watching all the way up until this point i appreciate you it means a lot um but destroy the like button because it if you found value in this video okay because as you can imagine it took a long time to be able to put all of this together for you guys and show you guys you know exactly behind the scenes what goes on and whatnot so definitely smash that like button um right now it means a lot but what i would do though is i would um, I advise you to try and open up a custodial account it's called um, if you're young or below the age of 18 um, it would involve your parents and whatnot but mm -hmm. it's it's good because at least you get started trading anyways yeah, yeah. and then um, when you turn um, the correct age or beyond 18 then everything else can be sorted and passed on that's because cool. obviously it was your account in the first place so if you ask me that's better than nothing yeah. um, to get started with so that's what, that's what I'll do definitely yeah. yeah yeah thank you yeah. very much that was the two questions I had yeah so that was the last two questions yep. you sure there's nothing else yeah nah literally you've answered everything, everything. <laughs> so there's nothing else um, so so what um, for the final um, sort of thing that goes through um, is you, you're going to receive your free share. I already showed you guys on the app um, what to do if you don't receive your free share, which is not going to happen. But just in case you signed up not using the link in the description, that's why I've I've put the link in the description for you. So be sure to use that link in the description. If you signed up without using the link in the description, then I'm afraid you won't get a share, a free share. But if you did, then you're definitely going to get it. Just be patient and wait. Just as AB is, is waiting and it's going to pop up. It should pop up. You see in your investments, mm -hmm. you've invested in Vanguard. 
um, then the rest of your investment will pop up basically it'll give you a free share uh, ban like Bank of America okay. like it well, Bank of America was what I got, yeah. as I mentioned. But for you, it might be something completely different, Random. something worth a lot more money uh, in the long run, which would be absolutely um, juicy, um, as we would say. So, um, yeah. But um, I've just double checked for myself. Um, it was definitely Bank of America that I received. That was my free share. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it. It might be a bit blurry on camera. Yeah, it's focused. There Is it not. focused? Yeah, yeah. So you see, does it say Bank of America? Yeah, it, it does. Nineteen pounds. So yeah, um, it's, it says it right there, and um, yeah. So that's pretty much everything. You would get that, and you receive it, and then you are laughing. You can pretty much do whatever you want with it. If you want, you can sell. You can sell the um, um, the free share that you mm -hmm. get, and then get money. Mm -hmm. Um, back and then cash it out or withdraw it from the app and then that's free money so say for example you get a share that's worth 88 pounds um, you invested one pound you got a share that's worth 88 pounds all you have to do is withdraw that money wow. it will take you 30 days to withdraw it because bear in mind they they are losing they basically just yeah. give you free money yeah okay say for example it was 90 pounds yeah, yeah they're giving you literally 89 pounds for free okay so it's definitely worth it if you ask me and um yeah and then you can withdraw it 30 days and within that 30 days it gives you time to see also if your investment may be appreciated in value and what you might see is you might actually not want to withdraw the money you might yeah. actually want to keep it in there and then reinvest and buy more shares which will make you more money in the long run which is um compound interest so meaning when your interest is compounding and you're just making more and more and more money from that if that makes sense does yeah. that make sense yeah. So, yeah 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 so you can go ahead and do that all right guys but that is pretty much for um that's it for today if you found um value in this video then be sure to a thousand percent uh smash that like button okay you see it right there that like button is very important uh, as well as the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so you can become a part of the mp family the mp fam and um join in the you know the, the the family of entrepreneurs and aspiring millionaires to come okay so thank you ever so much by watching this video you did not waste your time don't forget to tell your haters to get in line the subscribe button is right here you do see it right there and literally above ab's head it will be right here and right here so it will be covering his face but those are the two videos that you need to go and watch next if you liked this video you will definitely like those two videos right there the design for me um for, from me for you with love so that you you get the most out of this okay so if you found value in it once more smash the like button don't forget the link in the description also to sign up for the free share and uh, i will catch you guys on the next one peace out much love and um bye bye peace, peace out now